Good evening, I'm Caroline Dade. Tonight, a man is dead after a shooting on Madison's Isthmus. It happened in between East Washington Avenue and East Johnson Street, just blocks away from a popular park. Grace Hodak joins us now, and she has you covered on the details we just learned from police. Caroline, a lieutenant from the Madison Police Department's Violent Crime Unit, wrapped up a press conference not long ago. Right now, he says it appears the victim died from gunfire. The shooting happened near the intersection of East Dayton Street and Blair Street around 340 this morning. That's near James Madison Park. Police say they were called to that area for the report of gunshots. And shortly after, the 20-year-old victim showed up at a hospital where he died. Still canvassing the area, canvassing the street, looking for any information, looking for ring doorbells, um, any witnesses. There was at least, um, at least a couple dozen people at least that were present in the area of East Dayton and Blair Street. And I really didn't Attendant says police think people were in the area for a party and right now they don't think the shooting was random. He says he believes there's been issues at this address before. Tonight, police aren't calling this a de this deadly shooting a homicide. They say the medical examiner has to make that determination. If ruled a homicide, it would be the seventh one in Madison this year. Right now, the medical examiner has not released the victim's name, but we do know he grew up in Madison. Coming up tonight on 27 News at 10, Grace Olch speaks with a woman who had mutual friends with the victim. She has you covered on the reaction of those who knew him.